the country. While I prefer the town. Mm -hmm. When we put our heads together, we're the best combination around. Emily and Alexander, we're really quite a pair. again. <laughs> Sorry. We've traveled by modern steamship, steam train, and an ancient Chinese junk boat just to get here in time for the annual Dragon Boat Festival. It's been a long journey, but watching cousin Zhao Long win the Dragon Boat Race across Hong Kong Harbor is going to be worth it. Cousin Zhao Long is going to be an adventure. Where's a good spot to look for him? Yeah, he's anywhere but here. Whoa! special Chinchu dumplings for Dragon Festival. You must be Emily and Alexander from America. Well, yes. How did you know? Ha, <laughs> maybe I tell my good friend Yin to keep eye open for honored relatives. Cousin Zhao Long! Ni hao, hello, welcome to Hong Kong. Dragon Boat Festival, very exciting time. Oh yes, and this year my father is captain of our village Dragon Boat team. It's great honor to win Dragon Boat Race. There's more than honor at stake. The prize money from the race will let my father build a school in our village. Yin dreams of being teacher like his father. <gasps> Yin, son of Shung Li, the teacher. I have a message for your father. Tell him to forget about winning Dragon Boat Race if he knows what's good for him. Why don't you tell him yourself? Oh, father! Leave my boy alone. The only place I want to see you is behind us at the dragon boat races. Have it your way. We will soon know who is the best dragon boat. Be prepared to lose. Huan Fu is a mean man with an even meaner bird. Don't worry. Our courage will help us win the dragon boat race. But we must be careful. Some people will do anything to win. Come on. There is much to do. 
Wang Fu from Next Village is meaner than Dragon Woken from Thousand Years Sleep. You can say that again. Dragon Boat Festival celebrates Chinese virtues of cooperation and teamwork. It's my great dream to win Mouse Rat Dragon Boat Race. What's that noise? Sounds like a storm is headed this way. That not thunder. That rat dragon boat on practice run. You've got some tough competition, Zhao Long. Those rats look unbeatable. I lose race many times, but this year I have secret weapon to help me win. That sounds mysterious. Does it have something to do with your boat? You will discover secret in time. I don't know, Cousin Zhao Long. Your dragon boat isn't going to scare those rats. I was expecting something a lot more... <gasps> Scary! <laughs> Unlike rats, Hong Kong mice follow tradition. We keep dragon boat head and tail in village temple until race day. When did the dragon boat races begin? Here, I show you. Two thousand years ago, a poet called Chia lived in China. Chia was loved by all Chinese people. One day, Chia fell into the river. Everyone jumped into boats to rescue him, but he was never seen again. Dragon Boat Race honor his memory. Say, Emily, who does this remind you of? <laughs> Our friend, the Pekingese dog. Why, if you were real, Mr. Pekingese, I'd show you who's boss. Ah, good old Yankee spirit. That is why you are secret weapon. I need to win Dragon Boat Race. Us? Now, you official members of Mouse Dragon Boat Team. How can we be your secret weapon? We've never raced a dragon boat before. I know I can count on American cousins to give 110%. Oh, whoops! Uh -huh. Sorry. But uh, maybe it not hurt to make offering of rice to river spirits as well. Then we paddle. River spirits eat rice? Oh! Here we go! Well done, son. You are a fast learner. Oh, that's because I have the best teacher. And when we win the dragon boat race tomorrow, you will teach everyone in the village. Here, this is for being a good student. Whoa, a Xiang Pao. A lucky charm. Thank you, father. I must show it to my friends. I thought we came to Hong Kong just to watch the dragon boats. I never dreamed we'd get to race. Isn't it exciting, Alexander? Hey! Whoa! <coughs> <coughs> you could say that. That enough practice for now. Alexander, get ready to throw a mooring rope to shore. Paddling sure makes me thirsty. I could use a bowl of Chinese tea. Alexander, no, not yet! Whoa! Emily, watch out! Help! Hang on, Emily! Ah! Uh-oh. I think we made the river spirits angry. Please accept humble apologies. We weren't trying to catch you. Honest. I think our apology is accepted. Good thing, too. I didn't fancy ending up as his lunch. Oh, no! Chinese proverb, still water, not always run deep. 
us. Now we've definitely earned that cup of tea. Aya! What? What's the matter? Boat is damaged. Oh no! Can your builders mend the dragon boat in time for the race? Boat builders can fix but need wax to make repair watertight. Luckily, I know where to find some. Follow me. Where are we? This Chinese temple. Very special place. It's also very dark. I hope we don't wake any sleeping dragons. Temple provides for many needs. There are enough candle wax here to fix whole fleet of dragon boats. Hey, look at this! Hm. It looks just like the statue of the Pekingese dog we saw. Only this one's a hundred times uglier. Reason simple <gasps> is real Pekingese! What? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Run for it! Ready? Steady? Now! <laughs> okay, you big bully! I've had enough of you frightening my friends! Come on, shorty! <laughs> New York proverb. When the going gets tough, the tough get... Yeah! We must have woken a sleeping dragon! Do not be frightened, cousins. Oh, cousin Zhao Long, it's you. Now you know why dragons bring good fortune. We must get candle and dragon head to boat builders fast, so we're ready for big race. Who's there? <sighs> I was looking for you everywhere. Look what I got. It's a lucky charm called a Xiong Bao. We children collect them during the festival. Very nice. There's something else I want to show you. sure makes your boat look fierce, Yin. I'm sure you'll win the race and get the money for your new school. Yes, but we cannot race until the temple priest brings a dragon boat to life. What is he doing? He's opening the dragon's eyes. Hey, what's he doing now? Paper money is to keep away evil spirits. Speaking of evil spirits, there's Huang Fu. Yes, but where's his horrible bird? Wang Fu can't do anything bad with all these people around. I must go sell as many chinchu dumplings as I can. The new school will need ink and paper, too. I don't trust Wang Fu. I think he's up to something. You heard Yin. There's nothing to worry about. Hey, let go! That's mine! That's Yin! Come on! <laughs> I guess that greedy bird is still hungry. Wait a minute. Cormorants don't eat dumplings. They only eat fish. Huang Fu is up to something. I knew it. Look, cousins. He's headed for the dragon boat. <laughs> My plan worked perfectly. No one will notice this hole until it's too late. What's he doing? Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> we'll see just how good a teacher Shung Li really is. Hmm? At giving swimming lessons. Oh no! He's cut a hole in the side of the dragon boat! Hurry! We've got to get that piece of wood back to Yin before the start of the race! Get away! Leave me alone! It's okay, Yin! I've got him! I believe this is yours, Wang Fu! Now you keep your bird away from my son! Most humble apologies. I came to wish you luck before start a race. This better not be one of your tricks, Wang Fu. Come on, son. We have a race to win. Time running out. Dragon boat race starts soon. There it is. I got it. Well done, Alexander. Let's go. <gasps> He's after the piece of wood! Emily, catch! Here, yeah, Emily! Oh, this reminds me of your American game, football! Ah, oh, very rough game! Watch out! Got it! Uh oh Gotta hurt. Let's go. We must get to Yin before. <gasps> oh no! We are too late. Dragon boat race has started. Faster, father! Faster! I don't understand. The faster we paddle, the slower we go. <gasps> Look, Father! We've sprung a leak! That's no leak! This hole was cut on purpose! Oh, Chinese brother! Never trust man with black heart! <laughs> Chao Long's right, Emily. We'd need all the luck in China to catch up to Yin now. I know a way to catch Yin. Quick, Cousin Chao Long, please hand me some rice. Faster, Father. Huang Fu is getting away. There's still a chance if we can find something to block this hole. There must be a way. Son. Okay, now let's win this race. Let's go. We have our own race to win. Here's the finish line. We're going to be rich. Start of the race. Thank you. Hong Kong Rice, let's go. Those rats sure know how to paddle. Faster, father, faster. We're going to win. Faster, faster. It's going. My dream of winning Mouse Rat Dragon Boat Race has come true. Yours isn't the only dream that came true.
I'm not going to let them get away with this. That money should be mine, and I'm taking it. Let's go. Look, father. Now we can build a school so you can teach everyone in the village. Look out! Aya! Yin, did the bird hurt you? I'm okay, father. But our prize money's lost. This is all your fault. I should turn you into a pillow. Take this! Get away from me! Aya! <laughs> Poor Yin. It looks like his village is not going to get a new school after all. His dream lost in river. Just like Chia, we never see again. Not while I have a pocket full of rice. Hello, honorable friend. I have one last favor to ask. What cousin Emily doing? She see, I like for you to go into the wine. We're about to find out. Oh, thank you, Mr. Fish. See what I mean? Oh, thank you. Father, father. It looks like Yin's village will get a new school after all. Thanks to cousins from America. And the Hong Kong mice. Yeah! This headline, Emily. Britain takes control of Hong Kong for 99 years. I wonder what they'll think about the Dragon Boat Festival. Mm -hmm. I'm sure they'll love it. I know I'll never forget Cousin Zhao Long. Or the racing dragon boats of Hong Kong. <laughs>